Man, I'm glad I managed to block one of them. All right. Got him. That got me quite a bit of XP for that, to be honest. Not bad. Right, so this is where Jin will be, if he still exists. I, I don't see why he wouldn't. Ah, uh, and there he is. Oh god, really? I really hate this. Jesus Christ. See, stagger looks really cool, but it's just one I don't think I'd be good at using. Because it's literally just all over the place. Oh my god. Oh dear. Fuck me. <laughs> Somehow I knew that was gonna happen. As soon as I noticed my health being at like a quarter. So, yep, I'm dead. Where the hell has this put me? What? Oh, wait, okay, never mind. It seemed like I was much further away than I am. So I really don't mind it. No enemy. I'm shocked. I also don't know how many shards I have. I think I've got three. Might be useful just using them whenever possible, really. Yeah. Either way. Yeah, he's guarding the way, so I don't get a choice. But to fight him. I've also realised that I'm like, screwing myself to begin with. The thing I don't like about Stagger is the fact it's so... It takes so long for some of the moves to actually hit you. Yeah. Ridiculous. Boop, doop boop, doop doo 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 And they're fucking powerful. Jesus. Yeah, I'm doing my usual. Woohoo! Ah, oh, you dick. Oh my god, I might not get past him now. Jesus. There is a chance I could probably just run past him, but I have no idea. I'd much prefer to just fight him, because then he'd give me XP. Wait, what? Now two enemies have spawned here. Great, both of them. Fuck. Nice. Jesus. Oh, nice. We got him! Right, don't sprint. Jesus. Leaving me with half stamina to deal with him is not good. <laughs> yeah, because I can't even block all of his moves. I'm pretty sure for him to do a full, like, chain of attacks, he uses up a full stamina bar. God, he's good at fucking dodging about. I just like fainted multiple times. Oh god, I didn't even think. Fuck. Yeah, I didn't think about stamina at all. Oh god, I don't have enough shit. Jesus Christ.
Thank Christ. Oh, damn. I only managed to beat him because of my shards. Fucking hell. So that gives me 0 0.5, 0 0.5. Oh my god, that gives me 22 health. Yeah. I guess I got like a shirt. Oh, okay. Water shock. It's not that good. Wait. Still only got 650 shards. Ah, oh, man. Oh, that guy's still here. Hmm. Just shamelessly between planes, as you grow stronger, you will arrive on planes with older, stronger prospects. Be ready to have your combat skills challenged even further. Great. <laughs> Right, the door should only be over this way, I think. I think it's over this way, over a bridge, and then you, that's pretty much it. I think so. I did not want both of them. Fuck. Right, so that was a left burst combo. Oh, yeah, yeah, I got fragments. Oh my god. Ah, oh, that would have been such a good end to that combo. Ah, oh, it would have been perfect. Right, either way, I think I could just go up here. Oh, no, I can't. Yeah, this leads somewhere else. Is the door over there? I can't remember. Oh. Hey, friend. Oh, wow. Got some different movesets, it would seem. Oh, there's the door. Hey, old man, how do you do? I am your final challenge. Be wary beyond the gate. The essence reserves are infected by fallen prospects. They are fascinated by it even more so than the pagans who call themselves, called themselves Adalians. Thank and look, we now control the essence. What did he actually say? Adalian, Adalians, Adalians, either way. I can actually go beyond the gate. Oh, oh nice. Whoa. Oh, God. Ah, oh, good checkpoint. Perfect. Okay. Did say be careful because of, I don't know, fallen prospects. Is that another checkpoint? What's the point? I don't need constant checkpoints. The Essence Reserves. Ooh, wow. This is a new area entirely. Shit. Okay. Did I learn that? I think I may have. Ooh, nice. Oh god. Ah, oh, I'm so lucky he didn't decide to hit me with a barrage. Nerve attacks. We got Falcon Punch. That's what that is. Yeah, it's where they just have a really big lead up to an attack. They're also not better. They are rags, so I'm not surprised. Where's Falcon Punch? Not that. That does so much damage. Holy crap. That's the illusion twist kick. Stretch out hook. Falcon punch has got to be somewhere. There it is. Falcon punch. Wait, so that would leave me in. Okay, we have that one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Neither are. Falcon Punch is pretty cool, but it's not one I want to add. I don't know, I just think it's too slow of a move. And most enemies will probably be able to block it entirely. Well, more so counter it, I mean. With like parrying or something. I did not expect this to be another air, like a, a new complete area. I don't know, I just assumed it would be like an altar and then a boss. Stupid of me, really. Oh, great. 
What the fuck? Okay, you seem... Like you know your stuff. There we go, I just wanted to dodge. My god. Heart bag. Jesus. They're fucking good at dodging. Jesus. Yeah, I'm realizing now that my dodge speed's actually really slow. It's because I'm weighed down. It's fine. I don't really use that that often. Useful. It's useful for getting out of the way of certain things. That's about it. Oh god, there's all of, there's loads of these. Great. Oh god. Fucking combo. Okay. Seems that's a like a standard. Okay. You fucking harbag. Yeah, jeez. She's constantly dodging past my attacks. Super shitty. No altar? Are you serious? Oh my god. You have a different moveset entirely. Knew it. Oh, Jesus. Is this just going to be the really powerful attack? Yes, it is. Right, you're going to go for left or right? Left or right? The right. Yeah. Screw you, prick. <laughs> God, I've just realized, if I die, I have to go through all of these again. Whew. I mean, it's not that bad. Like, if I do die, I'll just have to learn their attacks and everything. Well, it just gives me more of a chance to learn their attacks. So there's a can over there. No altar, though. Hmm. Wait, orange. Okay, perfect. I guess. That's what I wanted. Did not kill them. Crap. <laughs> Kinda hoping it would. What is this? Is it sword? Nice. What the hell was that? It was some kind of top. Oh, it's lighter. That's all that's good about it. Okay, so we have another one over there. I'm assuming they are probably purple. Like health bar. Yep. In which case, I don't really want anything to do with them. Unless... Ah, oh, shit. I was going to say, unless there's an altar, but there isn't. Oh man. Nice. Okay, maybe... I just want to deal with the altar. I just want to find an altar, more so. Is there not one? At all? Oh my. I mean, if there is, it's probably at the top of those stairs, but I don't know. What does it actually do? Nothing. Okay. It's got a rope attached to it, I thought it'd be useful. It's a shortcut. To be honest, that's an, actually what I thought it would be at first, but... Oh! Oh no, they're not bodies. Ooh, I made that a whole lot darker than I should have. It looked like a body. So I was ever so slightly worried. Do I dare use a weapon for this? Oh crap, don't get a choice.
shame me. Holy crap. Fuck, Jesus. Oh my god, I got fucking lucky there. Woo! I was like, oh god, I've got, I'm gonna die. I have to do all this again. Folded eyes mask. Uh, okay. Oh dear. Wait, so what the hell does this do? Glowing eyes on floating stones conceived by a twisted soul. Some find it nightmarish, others see it as an omen of knowledge and foresight. Increases my damage and my speed. It also is a very steamy mask. It would appear. Alright, so we dealt with... Well, we've dealt with all of the lost prospects on the way up. It's just, is there going to be a damn altar? That's what I want more than anything. It's I like either an altar or a checkpoint. Either would be fine. But whether I get either of those, we'll see. Hmm... Oh, well here's a door. Does that actually lead anywhere? Nope. Ah, oh, I saw that then and I was like, oh, an altar. Yeah, it isn't. Wait. Okay, I was gonna say the game saved. I get the feeling that doesn't mean a damn thing. What? Whoa. Hmm? Oh yeah, checkpoint! Yeah! The Imperial Quarters. This place is super dark. <laughs> I can see barely anything. Okay. Hmm. It's also very quiet. Don't really know how to feel about it at the moment. It's also that. Wait, so what the hell does this lead up to? All this. A doll you can't use. I'm gonna assume this is probably the same deal. I can't even go up those stairs. Alright, lots of dead ends. Wait, the old man. He's here again. When we first came back to Raslin after the downfall, the tower was filled with decomposed bodies poisoned by the sulfur fumes. All their might and glory did little to protect them when the earth split open. By then we knew how to fold we and we removed the dead. Pagans and infidels have no place in sacred graves. Or groves, I think is what that was to say. Oh dear. Hmm. Very interesting place. Great, I can go one of two ways. Hmm. I'm also just walking because I'm like, hmm. Are they gonna be a dick and like hide an enemy? Oh god, right next to me, me. This definitely looks like it's leading up to something grand. Certainly does. I like it. I really do like the um, the detail and how everything looks in this game. It's really detailed and really nice. I was wait waiting for that to hurt me just enough to kill me. Okay, I thought I would use those and it would open the door. But it would appear not. Oh. Alright. I mean... Oh, never mind. I was to say, this also looks super fancy. Where am I going? <gasps> yes! Oh, finally. Oh. 
Thank you. Have I got any shards? 775. I could probably get a new top. Oh, no, I can't. They're very expensive. They're also not that great. What gloves? Okay, belt. None of those. Trousers. Can I get trousers that are better in both ways? Oh, no, I can't. I just realised how much they are. Shit. But shoes. They're also not any good or any better. Oh god, that looks creepy. I'm gonna say this is probably where there's the most options because it's the masks. They're kind of like the a very big point of the game. What the hell is it? it's seven thousand <whistles> mirror mask? Oh, bad. I dropped the weapon. It seems everywhere sealed. It my only way to go is forward. Uh, oh. Is this the final? The, the final boss? It certainly looks that way. Yeah, it does. So we're actually at the top of the tower, I suppose. Alright. Let's see. Oh, God. I'm assuming it's probably her. Wait, is she gonna throw him off the edge? Oh my god! Oh no! Wow! So that's what happens to lost prospects. Oh dear. Ah, oh, great. Keep attacking. I did that too early. Oh, now she's using a sword. Okay. Not a fan of the swords. If I can hit her enough, she should drop it. Oh dear. Ugh. Nope. You're a bitch. I also like that the shockwave seems to actually make me learn a move. Oh shit. <laughs> I just took a took an elbow to the face. That wasn't too bad though, for my first try. Oh great, hi. So I'm actually like locked in fighting. Nice. Right. It's when she gets the sword out, I should probably pull mine out too. Too early. And the fact I did that too early just meant I en ended up getting my ass handed to me. You shitting me?
damn it. I'm not used to, like, parrying sword strikes. Fuck. <laughs> damn it. Ah, I'm so close. Did I actually drop the weapon then? Oh, my God, I did. Oh, it broke. Well, it broke for the time being, I guess. Shit. Shit. Oh, nice. I'm surprised I actually managed to parry. God. Oh my fucking Jesus. How much stamina does this bitch have? Like, what? I fucking hit her already. Great. Her stamina is ridiculous. Trying to just stay away from her. Jesus. Oh my fuck, Jesus. I did the- I'm- <laughs> The worst part is, I did the best my first fucking try. Why does this happen so much? Like every single time, it's my first try is the best try. It's retarded. Oh, nice. Alright. She's... Oh, God. This is why dodging is so fucking stupid. It's pointless. You move literally a foot away, at which point they can just catch up to you straight away. What? I'm doing my shockwave, you bitch. Po bag. Wait, how did she attack? I'm confused. She like blocked and attacked. Great. Oh my god, I got her. Yeah! I just wanted to cheap, like, do that the cheapest way I could. Oh my god. That was one hell of a fight, though. But I just kind of cheaped it by using my skills. It was well worth it. What? Uh, okay. Whoa. <gasps> oh. Oh, so is this literally just a test? It was all a test. To find... Well, maybe not to find an Absolver, but... Oh man, look at us. What a badass. No, that last fight was actually a really good one. It's just, it got to a point where I had very little health. Very little hell. So I was like, if I just used Shockwave mul like twice in a row, I should. You know, if I use Shockwave twice in a row, I should be able to kill her without much issue. 
Because she had very little health too. I managed to get rid of her sword at the very least. Rizrin Sword. You are now an Absolver. Yes. Downfall mode has been unlocked. In combat trials menu. Oh. Yeah, I'm not covering. Downfall. I apologize. That was never my intention. The only thing I wanted to do when I like started this game was I wanted to beat the story. Even though the game is or oh, the game's story is told in a very Dark Souls esque way. In that it gives you very little information and all the information you get is basically from just the random dudes you find all around the place. What do I want to increase? It does not really matter. We did get Riz uh, Rizrin's sword. I was about to say, it's actually not that bad. Oh wow, it's really good for Forsaken. I wonder, if, does she change... Hmm... Is her combat style the exact same as yours? Because it's just it just so happens that hers is a... Uh, what is it? What the heck? Wait, isn't that the door at the beginning? Or is that the stone of Adal? At uh, the, the door in that place. Until all the Mark ones are defeated, you'll not be able to reach the Hanging Gardens. Hunt them down and defeat them. Although they will come back after they fold, we will know that your deed is done. Uh, okay. What a random thing to say. So I'm curious as to what the hell that is. Oh, uh, wait, no, no, no. That is the, um, the door that you have to get, that I just went through that leads to the essence place into the top of the Tower of Adal. Ah. Actually, wait. I don't think I got any essence, but what could I buy now? Oh, I actually understand what that means now. It's level 10 in Downfall. Yeah, Downfall's like procedurally generated maps and stuff. It sounds really cool, it's just because it's procedurally generated and doesn't really have a story. Not because it's procedurally generated that I don't want to do it, it's more the fact there's not really any story, it's just a dungeon you go into and see how far you can get. There we go, we beat Absolver. This game was incredible. Very short which is a shame, but I think it's because most of the game was focused on the multiplayer aspect, which is completely understandable. But the single player is pretty damn solid, and it's a very... I don't want to keep comparing it to Dark Souls, but it's a Souls-esque experience in terms of how the story is told. <laughs> combat kind of, but the combat only kind of because it's one of those that's very challenging. Or more so, it's kind of... it's easy to learn, Actually, no, it isn't. It, it's a fairly complex, complex system, to be honest, with all the combat stances, um, special skills, different oh, combat trees, and all sorts. There, yeah, there's a lot to it, but it was enjoyable nonetheless. I sucked when I first oh, did my first session, as in the failed session where I played as not the wrong class, it was just a class that was not for me, and then Forsaken, and I managed to beat it. Hooray! I'm very happy. But that is going to be the end of Absolver. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this adventure. And until next time, take care.